when I was 40, I decided that we weren't going to run anymore, that we were going to sprint and jump. And my guys kind of looked at me like, are you sure this is a smart coach? And I said, I don't know, but I'm sick and tired of coaching guys that hate what they're doing. Right. And so it was really just, I really just gave in and said, said, I want the best athletes of my school running track and field. If we get that done, even if I poorly train them, we're going to beat other teams. I knew that to be true. What I didn't know to be true was when we started writing down sprint times, mm -hmm. what we were doing was effective. So trying something that like no coach would even consider, um, <laughs> not running a lap ever again, never, ever, ever running a lap in practice. Um, and it worked. It's it's very it's very interesting because you know we think when you think about the speed and and the interval workouts that coaches have done in the past, they rarely they especially at the high school level. I